CACID is promoting interreligious and intercultural dialogue around the world to have a more peaceful world. Today and this uh, weekend or these days, we are here in Fisksetra in Sweden. For now, we have the 7th Network for Dialogue meeting and some 20 Network for Dialogue members are here to learn more about God's house. A Network for Dialogue gathers faith-based and civil society actors, organizations and individuals who are working on the grassroots level as supporting refugee and migrant social inclusion in European societies. Network for Dialogue members use dialogue in their work and this is why we are here today. We are in NACA at God's House, one of our Network for Dialogue members, actually to experience this dialogue from the first-hand experience. Uh, dialogue in the work of God's House is visible on many levels. It is uh, interfaith but also intercultural dialogue. God's House is unique. We have been very impressed of what we have learned today because the community of Fisk has a place where people can come together. We are really delighted to see what Reverend Karl Dahlbeck and his team and the volunteers are able to do here. The practice is that we have um, one day uh, grassroots experience with our members where we learn about their work, uh, where they, we, we learn how they use dialogue in their work and why this is important and relevant and what is the impact of their work. Uh, this serves for us uh, as a network of 25 members from 15 countries as an inspiration and as a motivation when we return to our countries, how can we implement similar activities on the ground. Because, as a matter of fact, God's house is an idea, it's the lift practice that can be a role model for many other cities around Europe and, for that matter, um, for many cities around the world. Many of our members are going to be uh, more inspired, but also more motivated when they go back to their home countries, to their own organizations, how the work can be done in this uh, way that is bringing community together, bringing different faith leaders, faith actors, but also different cultures together. We're also having here a workshop with 40 participants from around Europe. But we are going to discuss the topics of social inclusion in European cities. And we specifically look on the topic of migration and on countering hate speech. We're collaborating here with God's House, because God's House is a unique partner there, as well as the European Council of Religious Leaders and the OSCE Office for Democratic Institutions and Human Rights. So it's been uh, very interesting to be able to be part of these international moments where we get in touch with other communities um, that are also uh, engaging in this kind of work and be able to share uh, experiences and develop new ideas and come up with innovative approaches as there are challenges always coming up. Migration is a very um, diverse field and we have to keep adjusting our responses uh, all the time, so it's been a, a very interesting um, partnership as well and uh, because of that we were also invited to come to this workshop uh, here in Stockholm and to be part of this exchange. Because dialogue is the only possible way of the pos positive future that we can all have in Europe. Okay.